In this video, we're going to brew coffee using the Chemex coffee maker. Chemex is one of my favorite way of brewing an amazing cup of coffee. For today's video, we'll be using a Chemex brewer. It has different sizes, but for this video, we're going to use a 3 cup Chemex. But this recipe, you can use it in other sizes of Chemex. I prefer the Chemex coffee maker because of its clean cup. Chemex has a bigger filter paper that has a thicker texture than other manual brews that gives a more clean cup of coffee. So today I would like to share with you our recipe. We're going to use a 1 to 15 ratio. We're going to use 20 grams of coffee, then extract 300 grams of coffee out. We're going to use a 93 degree temperature and we are going to grind our coffee on a medium to coarse grind size. So we will fold our paper filter. Just you start by folding it in the middle. Then folding on the corners. Then folding it one more time. Then finding the center of the paper filter. So when you're fixing the paper filter into the Chemex, the thick side with the three paper filters is the one which sits on the spulp side. So we will pre-wet our paper filter to remove the paper test. And also it helps in the warming up of our Chemex. Start by weighing our coffee beans. We will need 20 grams of coffee beans. Then we're going to grind our coffee on a medium to coarse grind size. We'll pour in our 20 grams of coffee. Then tally our weighing scale, then start our pour. We'll start by pouring 50 grams of water into our grinded coffee. And this is our brooming period. We'll let it sit until 40 seconds. At 40 seconds, we'll pour 100 ml of water into our coffee. This is our second pour. We will pour in a circular motion, then end in the center. And we'll let it sit until 1 minute and 20 seconds. At 1 minute and 20 seconds, we will pour our last pour until 300 ml of water. So we pour in a circular motion, then end in the center. So we we'll let it sit until three and a half minutes, until the water all drips down. You can swell our coffee to remove the grains on the side. So our brew is finished, we will just swell our coffee to ensure it's well balanced. And our coffee is ready. 
by following this recipe step by step, it's not that complicated. You can easily brew an amazing cup of coffee and have that great experience. Just a tip, whenever you're brewing coffee, make sure your coffee is freshly roasted and freshly grinded so that you can have an amazing experience. So this is one of the easiest ways that you can brew an amazing cup of coffee using the Chemex coffee maker. It really gives a cleaner cup. I would compare it to other coffee brewers and it's a great experience. I would like you to try it either at home or in a coffee shop. Let me know down in the comment what you think and how the test was. If you like the video, give a thumbs up for me. I will leave the ratio in the description below. Subscribe to the channel so that you don't miss any upcoming videos. I'll be uploading more videos. Thank you so much for watching.